The Afghanistan war, 13 years, two months and counting, comes to an end January 1st. You know, we've lost over 2,000 American men and women who have served our country over there. They brought Bin Laden to justice. Now it is time to bring them home. President Obama, who's making good on his campaign promise to end two wars, paid a Christmas visit to Marines in Hawaii. And I know that I speak for uh, everybody in the entire country uh, when we say uh, we salute you. Well, America's mission is ending in Afghanistan. The fighting isn't. So the war is heating up. It's turning into an all-out ethnic civil struggle. Thousands of American troops will stay behind to help the Afghans continue the fight. Senator John McCain is among the critics convinced the job is not done. He spent Christmas in Afghanistan's capital, reassuring leaders there that American support will continue after U.S. forces leave. Even as troops in Afghanistan are packing up and heading for home, other American forces are bearing down in their struggle to keep Iraq out of the hands of ISIS terrorists. Dozens of targets bombed in the latest round of airstrikes. A reminder that ending a war isn't the same as winning the peace. Brian Moore, NBC News, Washington.